With hidden green parks across London inviting the public in for Open Garden Squares weekend starting this Saturday, we visited the Roehampton Club to find out why it's such an exciting new addition to the project. Well, for a start, it's an absolutely beautiful garden. Um, and there's a really strong community ethos here at the club. So they have a lot of members that are drawn from the local area. And in many ways, it's a good example of what those open garden squares are as well, in that it's a space that is normally for a select group of people. Um, but this is a chance for the local community to get inside, to see what's actually on their doorstep in terms of green space and to share it. It's been a, a big, long uh, period of uh, anticipation for us here. Uh, we've, we've put a lot in, of input this year into making sure that it's going to be a, a successful event for members and for members of the public to actually see and uh, see the hidden gem that we have here at the Roehampton Club. We are one of the greenest cities in the world. I think we're the third greenest city in the world. and. The fact that all of these spaces are tucked away and actually we have been able to preserve a huge amount of that green space in the face of such pressure from development I think is a really great thing and I think that going forward housing developments do have to take into account that a home and the kind of spaces that people want to live are not just indoors, people want some way of getting outside and interacting with that outside environment as well.